Hey everybody, it's Kat, and I have something that I am excited to share with you. This is from our generation, and this is Kathleen from the OG Professional Collection. I dream to be a director. So what is super exciting about this is, you guys, my oldest son actually bought her as a gift for me because, of course, you know, I spend a lot of time behind the camera and her name's Kathleen, which is very similar. And so I thought it was super sweet that he picked her out for me. So what do you say? Let's get her out of the box and get a closer look. Isn't she pretty, you guys? So now we've got to get the packaging off of her shoes and remove the tag that's holding her hat on or her beret, and then we'll be ready to meet Kathleen. Okay, so I got, I found the one tag up there, but then she also has a tag here and here by the ears to hold the beret on. And then she had stitching underneath here to stitch to the sweater and underneath here that we had to remove and then it was easy to remove the little packaging that was just holding her shoes on so here she is I am excited to see what's under our beret here so let's take that off oh she's so pretty isn't she look at her now her hair is, they've got it up into two little pigtails. She has a part that goes all the way down the center of her head. And this was kind of odd because in the packaging they had this rubber banded in and so it kind of fuzzed up her hair a little bit. So I'm hoping that box hair will kind of settle down a little bit. So she is a little blondie. And as you can see here on her sweater, it velcros here in the back like so. She is, she's really kind of, she's cute. She's got a little belly on her. I mean, you can see where it's kind of pulling on her sweater. I don't know if they'll all be like that or if it's just this particular doll. Can you see that? She is a pie-eating, pie-loving little girl, so she's really cute. So let's take a look at the scarf. So it is done in kind of a fleece and just tied at the neck like so. So you can wear it with the scarf or without, but it does make her look kind of professional, don't you think? And then it's got the fringe on both ends. And then this little cable knit sweater that's done in kind of this mauvey pink. It has a little Our Generation tag on it. And then she has this, I don't know, would you call it a herringbone or tweed pleated skirt that's done in kind of the brown and cream. It also Velcros in the back. And then she does have purple underwear on underneath. And then here are the shoes. Yeah, they're done in kind of an, a hard all of vinyl and then it has the cute little pink laces. It actually reminds me kind of of like the chocolates in a chocolate box with pink frosting. I think they're really cute, don't you guys? Oh, I mean, and look at that face. Oh my goodness. I love her eyes and I love kind of how she, she has a little bit of an ornery look, don't you think? They are a dark brown, and then she has a feathered brow. She actually is kind of similar to our Sarah that we unboxed a while back. Let me get her and let's put them side by side, okay? Okay, here they are side by side. This is Sarah, and if you haven't seen her unboxing video, you want to, may want to check it out after this. And then of course, this is Kathleen. So if you're looking on the Our Generation site, that gives you kind of an idea to who you want to search for. Obviously, you can see some similarities in their face molds. Now, let's talk about what's different. Okay, Sarah's hair is definitely a different color. It is a more of an ash blonde, and Kathleen is more of a golden blonde. She's got maybe a little bit of strawberry look to it. It's definitely a brighter blonde. Now, 
There's a little bit of difference in their skin tone. I would say Kathleen, she has a little bit more of a pink undertone and Sarah has more of a yellow. And the eyes, the eyes are definitely different. She, Kathleen, is a much darker eye, but they're still both, they're both brown eyed, but Kathleen is a darker brown eye. Oh, and one other thing, Sarah is parted over here on her left, and Kathleen is parted on the right. So let's take a look at the length. Look at the difference in the length. Sarah, actually, I have her pigtails up higher even, which takes up some of the length, but look how much longer her hair still is, even with the pigtails being higher. So she definitely has a longer hair than Kathleen does. So you can see they're really super close, you guys, but they're, they are definitely different. But don't you think they would make great sisters? Let's go ahead and we'll take a look at Kathleen's accessories. Okay, you guys, so first off is, I was, I think these are called monoculars. And so it's basically a handheld eye scope. So she can hold it up. We can put it around her neck. So let's do that. Take her hat off real quick. cute that just can hang around her neck like a so so she has that and then she has her tripod here which actually folds up and then expands it's got a knob right here so then take a look at what goes on it look at the movie camera you guys so it is a closed lens but it looks so neat. And see, of course, here's the front on, and then watch this. This is so cool. So this actually turns the film in there. And so you can turn it, let's see. So I can do it so you guys can see. Look at that. So isn't that so fun? So then this goes on top of here. That is unusual. I thought that would snap on there better than that, but basically it balances on there. And so it's not on there real great. That is, you can position it on there, but really I, I'd hope that it would kind of snap securely on there and then kind of rotate, but I can't get it and I'm afraid that I'm gonna end up breaking it off. I was using some pretty good force, you guys, and I couldn't get it to go any further in there. It does sit on there, but I may have to work on that a little bit more because I don't know. That's you can you can move it and it'll it'll but it is not, it's definitely not like securely attached. But I love the way it looks, don't you? It also has, it says script on it. It says written by OG Studios, directed by OG Studios, and then July 15th. And it, it's, it's all blank on the inside, but that is really fun. That's a fun accessory to have the big script. So what do you think of our generation's Kathleen? Of course, I am smitten because obviously it was a gift to me from my son recognizing what I do. I think she's super pretty and I love having these accessories. We're going to have tons of fun with those. So now you got a little glimpse of Sarah and now you got a little glimpse of Kathleen. I think Sarah kind of looks like the Hollywood starlet and she could be the sister and Kathleen could be the aspiring director. So if you haven't seen Sarah's video, you may just want to hop on over there and take a look at that too. And if you enjoy reviews like this, make sure to give us a great big thumbs up. That really helps us out a lot. And that's our collection for now. Until next time, we're off to film some more videos. We'll see you there.